<clears throat> Excuse me, guys. I'm coming back. I heard something. S somebody here is the type of person, they like to have backup plans. Some of you all, they want to use you as a concubine, a placeholder, side piece, mistress. This person wants to go back and forth between you and another individual. Somebody here could already be in a relationship or waiting for someone. Excuse me. Or um, they could be in a relationship or waiting to see if something is going to work. It's almost like a person here wants to make you feel they're in some sort of uh, situation. I heard the word crisis. Like they're in a crisis and find a soft spot for you. They want to make a soft spot, but turn it into a weak spot for them. The five of swords going to the um, contract card. It's like they want you to promise and that you will always have them. You know that, that little thing that people do if we lock in, ain't no switching up. They want to get you locked in with them, programmed a certain type of way, to think of them a certain type of way, so it'll make it easy and convenient. But something here is going to be a bunch of excuses. Something here is going to be a bunch of lies. Now, this person right here is coming at some of you all um, strictly as the king of wands. They want to sex you. Se that song, I want to sex you up. I want to sex you up. That's their motive. But they will benefit from you if you allow it. They think you don't see that. They think you don't recognize them. What's the king of wands intentions? Dang. Look at here. The king of cups inverted. You have the, a, a womanizer for some of you all. If not a person that is an emotional abuser, a, a, they trying to play on your sympathy, on your softness. The six of cups, I told you there is some sort of soft spot this person wants that, wants you to have. They're trying to find it. Like, where's your soft spot? Where's your weakness? What do you need? And it's almost like they want to present themselves to be a certain type of way. I'm this king of pentacles. Excuse me. I'm this king of uh, wands. I'm this emperor. You know, um, if you need something, I got it for you. But something is to lay with you, to sleep with you. I'll be on that crypt tonight. Hmm. They want to mesmerize you. Hypnotize you. But it's all a part of programming you to get you not to be able to recognize they're going back and forth. Or they're using you at their convenience. At I don't let me see something one more time. You more on this, you more on this King of Wands, this Six of Cups, and this King of uh, Cups. Dang. The World Card. First of all, they watch you online. The Three of Swords. And this is somebody here who's like, okay, I know you've been heartbroken. If you've been talking about your relationships, how it hurt you, you know, a person walked away from you. It's like a person here was saying, I would never do you like that. The nine of cups inverted. Yep. Someone here is building a case, case study. They're studying you, building a case against you. And what, the, what, what that simply means is this right here. This is this is specifically for somebody online. They're catfishing you because they're making themselves, they're presenting themselves to be the opposite of what they see you say, what they see you talk about, or what you post. Um, I see pictures like memes, memes, what you post memes about, something like that. They're doing the opposite. And somebody here feels like if they could just get you in the bed, if I could sleep with them one time, I got them. The Ace of Wands, yep. The Two of Cups and the Wheel of Fortune. This is somebody who... Now, there's a woman here. This person right here going to L for you bad. This person right here feels like you have something. It's like, they like, it's like they're saying, I could really... Man, I could really benefit off that. Live with you. Stay with you. Lay with you. Play with you. Whatever you do, don't sleep with this person. This is the kind of person that looks like they will sleep with you. And then say, well, can I spend the night? I want to spend some time with you. Spoon. I want to spoon you. That's cuddle with you. That's old school talk. There's somebody old doing this? Damn. This is lame. But the thing of the matter is they want to spend the night because somebody might not have nowhere to go. Or when the other person is mad with them, somebody here bounces around. Now, somebody here could have a queen of uh, pentacles, a uh, queen, an uh, empress, another empress, and a high priestess. You know what? Somebody here thinks they sleep.
out of your date certain people that may be upscale, appear to be upscale, getting themselves together, leveling up, working two jobs, going to school. I'm hearing refund, refund checks. This person got your ass all figured out, so they think. Because they want to pose as a lover. If you talk about your ex, post about your ex, or talk about relationships, they're paying attention. This is somebody here that may want to drink some wine with you, get you a little tipsy, get you relaxed. It's like, and for some of y'all, especially women, a woman is being preyed upon to get pregnant for a man that wants to make you his. But he want, this is like, this, this person plans to live off of you. The thing is, is to get you to open up. It's a it's a manipulate you to get you to open up <clears throat> to look at him or her as the ace of wands, two of cups, a good couple, a good relationship. That this person trying to psych you out. Dang, what was it? Yep. See, you feel it. You feel it. I don't know if you slept with this person, but some of you all, if you haven't, if you haven't, do not. And this could be someone here that's looking at you as a beneficial factor. Some of y'all could be a messenger or you just post a lot on your, you know, your profile could be public. They could have be watching you from a fake profile to see what you talk about. Look at there. They think your ass got daddy issues. And this is a person that is playing off of some sort of insecurity. <clears throat> they also feel like you're lonely and been looking for love desperate for love you see this card here that says thought you know what the old with, with the bad word of thought it is considered that hole over there but this person doesn't realize that you're a healer somebody here think you don't see yourself or they think you can't see them but their whole thing is if i can just f you this is an f boy or an f girl and they're listening to you Y'all, yeah, somebody you being preyed upon. They know you're anointed. That's why they have a they have a strategy. Take you out a little bit. They may spend a little money, money on you, but something is to reel you in. They're trying to bait you. You're being baited. They're looking at your size, looking at your dress, how you dress. If those of you all they have vehicles they're watching your vehicles i keep hearing something about school you're going to school where you are in school somebody here expects you to spend some sort of refund money on them it could be tax money as well something that you have got or something that you're getting but you're being highly pocket watched you're being highly sought after as well mm -hmm. they admire you but they admire you for what you can do for them. They have hidden motives, hid, hidden, yeah, hidden plans, hidden agendas. Now, someone here is, if this is, if this is a man, he's a gigolo. He looked for certain people that can take care of him or that he can, like I said, benefit from. These could be business women, businessmen he, he goes after. If this is a man, he's a womanizer. But whatever you do, you need not to sleep with this person. Just give it a little bit of time because you already feel something that's a little off. You get, you picking up the vibe, but you're like, well, maybe I'm tripping. And see, this is somebody here that's trying to play you like, nah, baby, I will never hurt you. Those of you all that have kids, that got, um, that are single parents, they could be trying to play you if your child parent, the other parent isn't there. But you're being profiled. All single men with children would do this. It's like you're lonely, you're desperate, you're needy. You should want this vitamin D. You should want this vitamin P. But it's going to come to you at a cost. Somebody here also, you, when you get their ass in, the, in your house, you may find they ain't got no damn job. They don't have nowhere to live. They go from pillow, pillar to post. Oh, oh my God. Yep. Acting real geeked up. Acting like they is just all together, but it's not. Look at here, the third house, knowledge. You're very knowledgeable, very intelligent, communicator. This person right here is trying to manipulate you. And this could be someone that some of you all have met through a family member or some sort of mutual friend or associate. Look at here, thinking of your divine counterpart. Some of you all, they're trying to manipulate you on that counterpart stuff, like they're the one for you. It's something about they're, they're listening to you Oh, when you talk to them over the phone, text messages, they're talking to you, listening to everything you're saying, analyzing it. But somebody here is getting something out of you about your ex or exes 
or people that have hurt you, picking up on daddy issues, mommy issues. They're picking up they're, they're picking up your insecurities to try to mimic them. To this is like traumatizing you or re trauma or trauma bonding you. But they're trying to find an insecurity to play on. Whack and lame. Whack and lame. This person ain't got no game. And they don't have nothing about themselves. What they want to do is look like they got it together. But they prey on, somebody here prey on specific people. They have a type. I want to say again to women, you're somebody's type by your profile, your attire, where you work, how you work, or how much you bring home. Your, it could be your hustle about yourself. You could be an upscale woman. You could be a hood, I don't know, hood woman, but you know how to make that money flow. You know how to get out here and get that money. You'll work two, three jobs. INDP. She got her own house. She got her own car. You independent. Hell no. Somebody is looking for an independent single person to smooch off of. This is a this is a smoocher. And this is online. They're watching you online. This could be somebody that's doing some online dating as well. This person is not all what they are cracking up to be, what you think they are. Scorpio, Leo, Aquarius, Sagittarius, and Leo. They got, this person got a plan for you. Um, I hear that song. I got a thing for you. By Trina. I, I got a, I, they got a thing for you. You're their type. Now, possibly, I'm going to put this out here. This person got a thing for you, but something is to lock you in with them. To get, I don't know, to get you locked down. Clank, because you keep saying clank, clank. You want to lock your ass in, honey. Damn. Damn. Oh, God. The high priestess. Honey, if you are, high, this, there's a high priestess that somebody wants bad. This emperor. I tell you, this person studying you, honey. Big time. And the four of wands, because you're stable. <gasps> the king of pentacles. Now, let me say this right here. Hold on. I, I, I hear something good. For some of you all that you, you carry your own or you work to obtain your own, somebody right here has not seen this in quite some time. They may, you're their type because of that, because you're self-sufficient, because you're independent. You will at least try. And that's why they're looking like, they, they see so much potential in you, so much more you could do, could be doing with them, or without them, etc. It's like they want a piece of the pie, but they want you. They want to add y'all together. This could be that power couple stuff. This is also a person, they may wonder if they are your type. So they're trying, this is a person trying to find a way, studying how to get you, what to do, what not to do more so. See this right here? Somebody here now, somebody here, you got a good option because they're an emperor. They could do that. This person could really see themselves really rocking with you, growing with you, and developing life with you. But something about them, they feel like they're, they may not be your type, but they want you. But others of you all, you need to be, be aware and don't sleep with this person, especially that those of you that, that resonate with the first half of the message because this person wants to sleep with you and it's like, bam, y'all living together. <laughs> But actually, as you gonna look at like it may take you some time because somebody here is asleep. When they leave your house, they may be going back to their sister house, going back to their cousin house, going back to their friend house, going back to their parents' house. Allie? They want to make you their ally. Hmm. All right. Peace and blessings, great day, love bugs. I hope this helps. Namaste. My God. Yeah, great day. I'm staying.